Southbound traffic looks like the same story there near uh, Santa Rosa Hospital, but overall, freeways are looking great this morning. Mark and Leslie? Thank you very much, Detective. We do have late breaking news. We're on the scene of a violent end of a high speed chase. A man is dead, and a pickup is cut in half in Castroville, where the chase ended. A Bear County Sheriff's deputy tried to stop the red pickup in far west Bear County near Alamo Ranch. Deputies are on the scene on FM 471. That's off of Highway 90 in Castroville. And that is where we find our Josh Skernick this morning. So, Josh, I see that you actually changed locations. Uh, good morning, Leslie. Actually, I found the red pickup truck, and it is cut in half. I'm going to move out of the way right now, and Gilbert's going to go and zoom in. Now, it's going to take a little bit, but as you can see, one half is in the front yard of one of the homes on FM 471. According to deputies here on at the scene, that truck hit one of the trees in the front yard. It cut it in half, and now if we go and we move the shot, we pan over, you can see the other half of the red pickup is in another yard. Pretty crazy. Uh, according to deputies here, the uh, male driver is at University Hospital with broken bones. The passenger is dead. He died at the scene. Now, how this all happened, they tell me that the chase reached speeds of just less than 100 miles per hour. Coming up 471, it started near Alamo Heights. Um, no, Alamo Ranch, my mistake. Alamo Ranch in far west Bear County. It then went 20 miles up the up 471 to Castroville here. Deputy tried to pull the truck over for speeding and blowing through a stop sign. One of the deputies does tell me that the driver has a warrant. They're going to investigate to see if that is the reason why the driver ran. We're going to have much more on this in a half hour as I continue to gather details and try to talk to some witnesses. Reporting live from Castroville, Josh Gernick, KSF 12 News. All right, Josh, thanks very much. We'll also